counting machine operation video, emergency stop switch set to on, connect power supply, turn on, the main power switch, turn on the conveyor belt and bottle, separator wheel power, speed to 90%, start by the touch screen control, connect ZL supply and adjust, ZL pressure to 0.6 MPa, from the rear side of the machine, pull, out the left and right removable, switches to lock the vibrator, the locking action can be observed by, opening the two stainless steel plates, pin up to loosen, pin down to lock, conveyor with adjustment, loosen all the set screws on the railing, one bottle on the left and one on the right, adjust the distance between the railing, and the bottle to one millimeter, Fixing screws after completing the adjustment, release the cylinder, adjust the bottom mouth, position to align with the discharge hopper. Loosen the four fixing screws of the discharge hopper. Adjust the position of the discharge hopper to align with the bottle opening, then lock the screws, open the conveyor belt. Place two bottles and observe if the front end sides of the bottles are aligned. Bottle change time setting, click green reset, while observing bottle movement, bottle change time to fast, bottle, cut in cylinder, click on parameter, click on time ACT, change bottle time E is the time setting, for the cylinder on the left side of the conveyor, change bottle time R is the time setting for, the cylinder on the right side of the conveyor, cylinder time to fast, increase value, time to slow, decrease value, modify and then click green reset, while observing the bottle on the conveyor, the bottle passes through smoothly indicating, the completion of the adjustment, adjusting the bottle sensor, the red light, should be on when there is a bottle, not when, there is no bottle, each channel is equipped with a bottle sensor, when there are no bottles, the channel will automatically stop working. Plug-in sensor at the end of the conveyor, belt machine will automatically stop working when it detects a clogged bottle. Machine debugging using capsuling as an example, adjust the hand wheel to adjust the height of the outlet to the height of a capsule, set tie bottle to 50, set vibrator ACT to E, enter vibrator parameter ACT, set vibrator parameter ACT to 66, star, observe the state of the capsules, parameters correspond to this. Stage vibration groove capsules overlap. Need to adjust the parameters. Click on the touch screen to stop working. Increase of RH for level E and level R vibrator. Click green reset. Adding bottles to the conveyor belt and opening the belt. Click start. Observe the E stage vibration and make sure that each capsule does not overlap. It is qualified. If R stage vibration capsules overlap too much, sign stage vibration. Reset vibrator parameter SET to 76550. Ensure that there is no overlap of E stage vibration capsules and that the overlap of R stage vibration capsules is less than sign capsules. Right vibrator is also put into the capsule and parameters are adjusted to be the same as the left vibrator. Debugging completed. Adding bottles to the conveyor, click green reset, then can start production.